Okay, super random video. As I make my oatmeal and I'm like about to slice and dice my bananas, I just thought how beautiful, how beautiful it is. Look at these bananas. I don't know about you, but for me, like this bright yellow looks gorgeous. And now all these brown spots like freckles, I think they're beautiful. So random, I know, but I find it gorgeous. And now make my my oatmeal and banana. And it's super hot. Oh yeah, that's hot. Okay. Chop, 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 chop. And then if I had two hands, I would just like plop it in there without having to have like banana all over my fingers. Let me try. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ha. Sort of. Not really. Gosh. Anyway. And then one right here. Alright you guys, so I just thought I would show you what I think is a gorgeous banana. <laughs> That's all. That's all I'm doing. Random, a little bit of randomness, but it's still beautiful. And I try to see beauty in everything. And that is what is beautiful right now. Beautiful, delicious, and nutritious. Simple, cheap, frugal, very healthy. Have an awesome one. Here we go, more simple eating. It was one big long carrot and I just chopped it into like little slices, little chunks. And I'm over here microwave baking a potato for my lunch. So I will snack on these until my potato's done. Put a little bit of butter and call that lunch. Let's see, I always have my water. I drink water like pretty much all day long. Mornings is my coffee. Then I'll have a smoothie. Um, most days, it's spring, summer, part of fall, but Mostly what I do is have my coffee in the morning and then just drink water all day long. Every once in a while, I might have a, a Coke or a Pepsi or a sweet tea, but I mainly drink water. Yes, talk about more beautiful, bright colors. There's a beautiful orange right there. Alrighty, so this is a huge potato. Put some butter on here. Oh, probably plenty. If not, I will put some more later. But I just thought I'd share my breakfast and my lunch and some randomness thoughts about beautiful, beautiful objects, beautiful colors. Yeah, beauty's in the eye of the beholder. And what I find beautiful is just about everything in nature. God's creations are gorgeous and delicious, especially a nice baked potato. Yummy. Yum, yum, yum. All right, I didn't finish all the carrots, but I'm gonna try to eat this whole big side. Maybe I'll get to that. Maybe I'll save it for dinner, I don't know. And talk about more beautiful colors. Can you make a smoothie? All these gorgeous colors plus banana I'm gonna put two bananas in here some water and blend it and I'll show you the beautiful green color Ooh. 
this is more like an avocado color. When I put the strawberries, it strawberries, <laughs> strawberries, it gets to be like more of a avocado color versus a bright spinachy color. All right, you see it a little bit better, a little bit of daylight going on here. Not as bright as I usually make it, but when I include the strawberries, then it gets a little bit darker, but it's still so yummy. Cheers. So I'm just relaxing, I'm watching a Tyler Perry movie and having a little snack. Okay, so for dinner, doesn't look all that appetizing. I had this frozen for a little while. Just a bunch of leftover veggies that I turned into some kind of soup. And it's been in my freezer for a minute. But, whoa, that was loud. So all I'm doing is reheating it. I've got peas, onions, maybe carrots, cabbage. I don't even know what's in here. Soupy surprise. <laughs> and then I have the potato, half of that potato from earlier. And I also have a choice of rice. Rice that I had previously frozen the leftovers. So I will heat this up and taste it. Hopefully it's still good. And pick either potato or rice to go with that. All right, it is warmed up now. And yeah, I don't remember what I was doing or how long ago I froze this <laughs> but let's give it a taste are you ready oh lord jesus look at this I don't know peas carrots onions cabbage maybe obviously tomatoes tomato sauce or diced tomatoes I don't know let's try it Not bad not bad it's a little I don't know if I'm tasting chili powder I think I might eat the potato with it yeah. it's good it's not spoiled it's it's good and anyway <laughs> <laughs> see which one tastes better do I eat it with potato or with rice okay let's see oh the rice tastes good with the soup but I know the potato is really good by itself too, or butter anyway. Mm. Okay, so here's the deal. <laughs> I am eating this mystery soup with some rice. And if I'm still hungry, I'm going to have the leftover baked potato and mashed potato. And this is going to be my dinner. Okay, so let's plop some rice in here and I'll heat this up again yeah you guys this right here and then if I'm still hungry then I will eat the potato and if I'm still hungry which I doubt it I will snack on a banana or carrots again yummy here it is, all mixed together. Well, this is better lighting. All right, and of course, my water. All right, you guys can probably see me a little better there. So thank you so much for watching my super healthy day of eating. Now don't be fooled. <laughs> I don't always eat this healthy, but yeah, today was a really good day of eating and I am pretty proud of myself but usually 
I will mix in um, once or twice during the week. I'll I'll buy something like some Chinese takeout, uh, pizza, go get some kind of pasta, some kind of Mexican food, uh, a burger, whatever it may be. I'll mix that in with all my healthy choices, and eh, it makes it makes uh, eating a little bit more enjoyable because I do crave all that yummy fatty food, but I'm trying to stay as healthy as possible for as long as possible. And this is how I'm kind of combining both of best worlds for me. So anyways, bye guys. Thanks so much for watching Dia's Frugal Life. If you enjoy the content, make sure to subscribe for more future videos. You can also join and be part of our coffee club. We would love to have you. Thanks for all the love and support.